welcome back now in this video we will try to solve more questions on the shortcut to ratio I mean we stood we studied how to apply the shortcuts of ratio and to solve the questions very quick for example this type of logics will be used in DI so you should be uh, highly uh, highly clear about what I'm doing so you try to understand and we will keep solving questions one after one and you take some participation in this video try to solve this question before I solve anyway so find the value so this is the question a is to b is to c is 4 is to 7 is to 11 if b is 21,000 find the value of a plus c so let me remind you what was in the shortcut you have to write something by something into a number on the top on the numerator part you will write the ratio part of what is asked in the question the ratio part of the question will remain on the top and on the denominator the, that ratio part will remain whatever is given in the question in this case this is b equal to 21,000 and here a simple number a plain number of the given data will be here for example find a plus c this is the question so question will remain on the top a plus c means you cannot you will have to write a c so go to the ratio part a and c a plus c is 15 this is the value of, a, of, of the ratio part of the question then on the denominator part b is 20, b b is given so i will write the value of the, the ratio value of the given data so this is 7 and here the number 21000 so this is nothing but so this is 45,000 is the answer. So this is one question. Now let's uh, make another question. I will prepare a question for you right now to practice more. Let's solve it this way. I write for you that question number two, if A is to B is to C equal to two is to five is to seven. And the given data is b plus c minus a is equal to uh, maybe it is one three zero zero whatever and again a question is asked find the value of a plus c minus b whatever is asking question anything let's try to solve this question very quickly so something by something numerator by denominator into a number on the top question will come so question whatever is asked in the question a plus c minus b a plus c minus b is asked that's why it will be in the top a plus c minus b is a plus c that means 2 plus 5, 7 that is 9 and 2 plus 7 minus 5 so this is equal to 4 so 4 will remain on the top and b plus c minus a is given so b plus c minus a so 5 plus 7 minus 2 that is equal to 10 10 will remain on the denominator part and here the number what is given so 1300 will be 1300 will be here so the final answer is 4 into 130 that is equal to 520 this is one more question that we created right now let's let me explain you one more question it's a bit more complicated I will try to make it more complicated but I'm sure this complicated question also you can solve so now I'm trying to make it more complicated for you so that you cannot answer the question but I know you will answer question number three Let, let's try this way a is to b is to c is to d is 2 is to 5 is to 3 is to 7 now I give you information like 2a plus b is equal to equal to maybe 18,000 find the value of find b plus 2c minus d this is my question let's say how you solve this question so uh, its answer should be I mean you should be clear about you can pause right now because I'm just immediately now I'm going to explain its answer but you try it first so pause this video and look for the solution just after you solve the question so now you can take the pause yes okay now we are back again so you your answer should be b plus 2c minus d b plus 2c minus d is asked in the question so b is 5 2c means this is c 2c means 6 double up this 
minus d minus d is 7 so 5 plus 6 minus 7 is 4 so on the top 4 will be there and on the below the denominator part whatever is given in the question so 2a plus b is given in the question so 2a plus b so 2a means 4 this is a 2a means 4 plus b is 5 so 9 is given in the question so 9 into the number 18,000 so this is equal to 8,000 this is the explanation to this question anyway I hope you understood it well and you, you can try this video once again if you are if you want more clarification good luck